hello friends welcome back in this video i will show you how i made this cylindrical planted betta fish tank though this tank has no filtration but doing a weekly water change will give you no problems maintaining this tank so let's get started first you need a cylindrical tank like this one you can check the local pet store or search it on amazon then you need a power stand like this one if you want to buy a power stand i have dropped the link in the video description this stand helps to cultivate the aerobic bacteria and maintain the nitrogen cycle in the tank then some sugar like a white sand and some rocks of your choice and some wood decors i found a variety of rocks for the betas to hide and also to move around first of all we start adding the power sand at the bottom of the tank this helps to cultivate the aerobic bacteria you can also add plant fertilizers before adding this power sand that can help in plant growth next we add the sugar like white sand on the top of it then i will make a slopey layer on the top so that it is quite visible and add the rocks and also the wood decors so the wood decor was not fitting properly so i cut it down now it's all right now i have some aquatic plants i bought from the local pet store some short going grass plants some tall plants i also have the tweezers and the cutters before adding the plant i will wet the sand surface or add water up to the level of the sand layer now the soil is wet we can easily put the roots inside the soil so that it does not come out i have added one tall growing plants towards the center of the cylindrical tank then i will add the short growing plants around it going outside so this will create a view So this rock is not allowing me to put the sand first i have to remove it and then plant the grass plants now i have planted the grass plants also i will add short growing plants so that it will look very green and dense like forest Now I have done planting the plants. I will place the rock decor just towards the center. This is my own idea. If you are also making this cylindrical tank, you can spark your own idea and create your own beautiful tank. Now I will add some more sand on the top just to hide the exposed root if any. Now after this I will also wet the surface again. just to form the plantation well if you have marimo moss ball then it is very good for the betta tank i didn't had any so i have the java moss 
so i wrapped it around the stone and i have added this as well so the plantation is complete and you can see that it is looking good now it's time to add the water i will gently add the water without disturbing the decors and all that so i am adding water on the top of the rock so that it will slides down slowly towards the bottom so some wood decors are coming up this is creating disturbance I will test it out which way I can keep this wood decor. So the wood decor is not going in, so I have to remove that wood. Now the wood has been removed, and it's time to see the cylindrical planter tank, and it is very looking very good. You can also create much beautiful tank than this one. Now it's time to add some fish. I'm adding a male betta fish. There it is. So it is looking very good. I have to do weekly water change. Rest all things are fine with this tank, and the betta fish is also liking it. What are your thoughts on this cylindrical planted betta fish tank? Give your thoughts and comments in the comment section below. If you want me to make another bigger betta fish tank, you can also comment it and you can also comment or suggest about the next video that I should make. So there it is, betta fish is coming out and it is looking very brilliant inside this tank. I have also a female betta fish so I can also add in this tank and they can spawn in this cylindrical tank I don't know about it maybe I will add it in the future if the male betta fish is making some bubbles on the surface that could be a indication So that's it for this video. This is how you create a cylindrical betta fish tank. Also, yesterday I found that in my discus fish tank, some eggs were laid on the rock decors. This is the footage about two weeks ago. There were small amount of eggs on the rock decors, but the next day I found that all eggs were gone. Those eggs were probably eaten by the discus fish itself, so they were laying eggs and eating them. 
I'm not sure they fertilize the egg or not so this is the footage about one week ago and there were more number of eggs laid on the rock decors so definitely there is a female that is laying egg I don't know about the male whether there is a male to fertilize the egg more news about it I will upload in the later videos if you are not subscribed to this channel please subscribe and leave a like on this video and share it with your friends until next video bye and take care and thanks for watching